History of Russia in 100 Minutes by Smart Histories. Soviet Russia. After creating the Soviet Union, Lenin died and a ruthless power struggle transformed Russia into the dictatorship of Joseph Stalin. World War II was followed by bipolar Cold War opposition with the West. The experiment of communism finally collapsed in 1991, having survived for 74 years. In the beginning, the prospects of the Bolsheviks were frail. Nevertheless, Lenin was able to consolidate their power by making peace with Germany, nationalizing all the land, and creating an effective system of repressions. On 7th of November 1917, the Russian SFSR, Soviet Federative Socialist Republic, was declared. Lenin's first government was called the Council of People's Commissars. On 30th of December 1922, the Soviet Union, Union of Soviet Socialist Republics, USSR, was formed. It initially contained only four republics, Russia, Ukraine, Belarus, and the Transcaucasian Republic. By the end of the USSR, there were 15 republics. In 1918, the Constituent Assembly was dissolved and all parties, except the Communist Party, were banned. The highest institution of the party were the Palabura and the Presidium. The most important official, the actual ruler, was the General Secretary of the party. The parliament, formerly the highest organ, but which in reality followed the guidelines of the Politburo and Presidium, was called the Supreme Soviet. The government was first called the Council of People's Commissars, and later, after World War II, the Council of Ministers. A special secret police force, called the Cheka, was organized in 1917 by Felix Dzerzhinsky. It was later named the OGPU, NKVD, KGB, and FSB. The highly effective organization began the Red Terror campaign against all who opposed the new Bolshevik government. The Soviet Union attempted to spread its influence in communism all over the world, especially to its neighbors. In 1919, the Communist International Comintern, was formed. Its aim was to unite all communist organizations worldwide, to carry out provocations, and to initiate revolutions in other countries. After World War II, the Soviet Union was successful in establishing its supremacy over the Eastern European countries, and in establishing governments that started building socialism in them. During its lifetime, the Soviet Union had numerous indirect armed conflicts over hegemony with the United States in several parts of the world. Thank you for watching. For thousands of helpful resources of Russian history, please visit our website at smarthistories.com.